work that we saw today is the very, very well crafted and articulate. There's a fantastic skill that our students have today in graphic representation. All the presentations are very good, amazing drawings, a lot of work behind each project. No? What did impress me was the rigour of the work. Now that's almost across all of the projects that we saw, all the work. I think I was really blown away by the overall quality. And I found that actually looking through those portfolios was really special. I think the enormous advantage in not setting a brief or establishing themes to respond to uh, is that students are completely free to define their own response to the medal submissions. It's a demanding couple of days, but the refreshing thing is that you're never quite clear what might be coming up next, and that is a real joy. I think when you get older and you're in practice, you, you get tied up with all the, the issues to do with just delivering a project uh, and really to have proposals and ideas that are free from that, I think is very important. For a project to be successful in the silver medal, it's got to find a kind of a sweet point between a level of pragmatism and uh, an ability for us to see it as taking its place successfully in the world and at the same time some theoretical or intellectual or poetic set of ideas that are overarching. Well, I, I thought it was a very enjoyable process. Um, we come from different disciplines, as you said, or different, different environments, um, but I think we all had that sort of common agenda in trying to find the best work. Everyone had their own distinct response and feeling to them. There was a lot of consensus of so which ones are the projects which we wanted to revisit and look at in more depth. The decision is made, I suppose, in light of a very informed discussion. I think it's very thorough. I think I would be very satisfied that the decision that was made was interrogated very, very closely. The panel, I think, worked really well together. The variety of opinions and so on, but it was a good, it was a team effort, and we came to some very good conclusions. The strength of the RIA President's Medals is it allows us to see portfolios from different schools internationally. I think that the number of people from 25 countries today subscribing to that makes it an excellent forum for us to see how ideas are being generated around the world. I think it's very, very important to, to give this medal for concept, for fantasy. Thinking is one of the most important things in architecture, is the theory. I think it's important to continue to acknowledge student ideas because uh, those are, in a way, the ideas of tomorrow. Architecture, really, the foundation of it is in those ideas. It can underpins every building, it underpins architectural design. So. For me, it is probably the most important thing. We are setting a benchmark for the profession to reflect on its own accomplishments, which can lead to heated debate, difference of opinions and so on. Actually, that's grist to the mill of, of the people in the profession. And uh, competitions such as this, I think, are really helping uh, that process of debate and discourse. Mm -hmm.